When I joined um, Client Manager Front of House, I created these policy and procedures that was suitable for our business and then obviously adapted them that anyone can put it into their business as such. But then I had to make sure that the staff all knew this because now I'm not there and they're all doing it. You know, but to start with, it was just me and it was like, <gasps> but straight away I had to train them once it was done. So they, and they just knew it and that's how it is. Yeah, you will still get people phoning you up when you're not there. The um, sink's blocked. Oh, I can't get hot water or whatever. And it's like, mm. what do you have to do? Go and follow the procedure. And it's like, all oh, right, I'll just go and phone the plumber then. You know, <laughs> you don't have to phone me. Like I don't go, right, I'll go and phone the plumber. It's like, no, go and deal it. You know, they'll keep testing it until they go, oh, I cut like a child, like pulling at your jacket until you answer. But I, no, <laughs> push the child away until they actually just go and do the, you know, that's just how it is. And then that becomes the new system, the new procedure that's in there. It will be tested, but you've got to keep that going and carrying on until it just becomes a norm. Just like when you get up in the morning, when you shower and you get dressed, you do stuff the same way. You put your pants on and your bra on whatever way, you do one before the other, you brush your teeth before or after the shower, you have this procedure that you do. If you forget to do that or something happens, you might forget to brush your teeth or whatever it is, because you're like, oh, you've been stopped. They, it's exactly the same. It's, it's done until it's just that routine.